Hey the internet, welcome to another episode of the John Graves Show, and today I'm talking to you about the Xbox One. Apparently, the Xbox One driver, uh, the, the drivers inside side of the system are going to bring a 10% performance boost for pretty much um, all of the games that were um, announced for the system. Devs were speechless with the PlayStation 4's 8, uh, 8 uh, gigabytes and GDDR5 RAM, but pretty much when they heard about this, and still speech, just, you know, so on and so forth. Pretty much this is kind of a thing that's, on, that's, that's um, there to kind of push games like Assassin's Creed ba uh, Black Flag, Flag to make them run at um, uh, 20, uh, run at 1080p instead of 900p. Or, um, uh, and pretty much pushes the uh, performance and also kind of can make games run at 60 frames per second. Mind you that this does kind of seem, or at least like in, in hindsight, this kind of seems really, really, really pointless solely because these are power, these are powerful systems and you would kind of expect them to kind of, have, to kind of be pushing this, this kind of power on their own regardless of um, uh, regardless of what kind of drivers they have, well, not necessarily what kind of drivers, but like how these systems were pretty much created, it's like the ones that uh, you got at launch. You would, you would, you would uh, kind of expect them to do this normally, but um, but uh, as it seems, it's like the PlayStation 4s pretty much its specs went from four to well, uh, one second. Um, with pretty much with the system like 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 the PlayStation 4, I said a four. Well, I, well, uh, I thought I said four, but it's actually a eight gigabyte um, GDDR uh, GDDR5, which pretty much at that point it's like, well, yeah, this thing can practically push anything that's on PCs today. Well, possibly not at like max settings of of the, uh, of, of the PC, but it can run it uh, pretty well. Same thing with how the Xbox One is. Well, now I well now it is actually kind of like a interesting thing to pretty much say like that most of its performance is honestly not going to be solely on the processor. It's also going to be on the drivers as uh, as well. That is pretty interesting, but at the same time, in hindsight, it really doesn't really matter all that much. But at the same time, hey. Hey, good job, Microsoft. You kind of did something right with, with your system, and pretty much these things are working well. You know, I wonder. I wonder. I uh, I I do wonder how often that that this is going to be used for games later in in the lifespan, such as like all the pet um all the exclusive that they, uh the exclusives that that they're bringing in now. It's like how much of their games are going to really rely on the driver system. Um, and also the uh, processor system as, as well. So, pretty much that does kind of like raise some in some interesting questions. But hey, until then, hey, you tell me what uh, you think down. You tell me what you guys think down in the um, uh, comment section. Keep watching anime. Keep playing those video games. I will see you guys on the next John Graves show. Peace out. I will see you next time.